let me talk to you about the stupidity of some people in worshiping an idol. The prophet Isaiah talks about this. He said in verse 3 of chapter 44, The craftsman stretches out his rule. He marks one cut with chalk. He fashions it with a plane. He marks it out with the compass and makes it like the figure of a man according to the beauty of a man that it may remain in the house. How can that be? There is only one God who is the creator and he cannot be represented by any figure. He prohibits us from making an image of what is in heaven above, on earth below or under the earth, which are figuratively demons. God wants you to approach him with this word from the door of your mouth. Shall we now see this testimony? How were you walking before, sister? I was using a prosthesis here. A prosthesis there? Yes. I see. Now do it like this in the name of Jesus. Do it again. Do it again. Do it. You have to do it more. Now, clear the way for her, folks. Walk normally now, sister. Start walking normally. It's getting better. It's getting better. Walk normally now, sister. It will get better. They are right behind you, and they will hold you if needed. That's it. Now come back. Come back faster. Come back faster. Come back faster. Be strong of good courage, says the Lord. That's right. That's it. That's it. Walk normally now. Walk normally. Walk normally. Walk normally. Go over there. Now come back here and run. Take a little run now. That's right. Run, sister. Run. That's right. And now what's happening? I'm better. I'm much better now. She is I'm much fine. better, folks. Of course she is. Shall we pray, Father? Take away from people the desire for idolatry. This, O oh God, is disgusting in your eyes. And many have been fooled into thinking it's a normal thing, but it's not. Father, help this person to change completely, to be transformed, to be a new person. Father, I rebuke all the evil that's in her life and say, leave in the name of Jesus. And you say, Amen.